Man, why do fairies have to be so weak and lame? Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm just watching again. I'm so sick of this crap. Why don't they just add the Japanese voices to the text? You know what I mean? For the English shirt. That would be so much better. I want to fight for the people I love. I want to fight! Oh, are we going to get big version or not? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> we're gonna get the adult version of Nut, and we- oh yeah. I feel like it would be much more hype if she wasn't already introduced in the chapter, but... You know what, who cares. I'm the state to protect my friends. Yeah, oh, she's a dagger, a wind dagger, let's go! Attack you- oh, but she's small version? Or, I mean, medium, medium knot? We got medium version of knot, not the big. I thought we were gonna get adult version of knot. But I, I guess not. Oh, <laughs> no pun intended. Regalia Digest. Hey there, folks. Goodbye, Wormite, indeed. Yay! I, I, thankfully, she's a dagger. If she was a sword, that would be like a feels bad for Galarantzel and Galileaf. We already have too many wind swords, especially with Templar Hope. Wedding Elisan. Yes, not here to eat mana cakes and kick booty, and I already ate all the cakes. Anywho, it's almost time to celebrate two and a half years of our adventure. Dang, it's already been two and a half years, guys. Two and a half years. Last Regalia Digest, huh? Emil caused some trouble. But we also got to meet lots of fun people! Ah, memories. Anyway, in honor of the occasion, I've got tons of Dragalia Lost news! Hope you brought a pencil! Folks still use pencils, right? Oh, what's up? Oh, you are you left Twitch open? Welcome to Hey, you might Dragalia Digest! For you, you might get some Fire Emblem Heroes collab news. Ooh. Okay, that's that's good. Free everything, anything free is good. Free tenfolds. What? Who that? Is that Mim? <gasps> what? We got a Mim ult? A Mim healer? Mim staff? What is that? What was that on the left? I need to know. I'm more hype about that Mim ult than this Galanaut. I no lie. This Galanaut was kind of underwhelming because I expected the adult version of Galanaut. Oh, that's Mi- Mir- Miriam? Is this like Mim's previous life? No, what? I'll, I'll take it. This. Take Dragon Waifu any day. Miriam. Dude, is that seriously Wait, me? Yeah. I look amazing. Yeah, you do look There's amazing. Kind of <laughs> power thing or so Lady Mim is based off of? Oh, really? Oh. Includes the Gala Dragalia with me in it. Oh, dang it. The Gala. There's gonna be free tenfolds for the guy. I'm still gonna pull a day one, though. I'm trying to pull for her. Even though it's not very Wormite, uh, it doesn't save Wormite. Miriam does look like a monk. <laughs> uh, I don't need Galileo. Do not. I already have Xena and um, Shell, so I don't think I'll do the Platinum Summon. But that's really good if you don't have any of those characters. That's a really good Platinum Summon. <gasps> Mini Mercury! Oh! So cute! So adorbs! Can we get plushes of the mini versions of dragons? Only missing Galaluka, not worth. Yeah, it, only if you don't have those characters. Let's see. What else do we have? Is it really worth it? That's yeah. Oh, Nina will have oh these are probably gonna be like hundred bucks. That diamantium mega pack probably hundred bucks. Superior oh the, the regular diamantium pack looking really nice. So make sure to visit our shop. But wait! There's more! Triple drop! Oh, dude, we're gonna go all in on Avenue to Fortune. 
triple rupees. Uh, what about high dragon trials? <gasps> Double drops for Agito rotating daily. Do we gonna go all in on that? It's super cute. Yeah, indeed. We gotta farm Agito. That's we're gonna go all in on those days. We gotta farm, 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 farm like there's no tomorrow. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Does anyone know anyone who won this? Anybody? Like, I feel like they just do this just to get people to retweet and like their stuff. I've yet to hear about someone who actually won this contest. What is this? New chapter? Monster Hunter? Monster Hunter! A man who became a hero? This is intense like Smash Brothers music. <gasps> Yudin for Smash? The time when the world's laws forge a rift between people and dragons. Such things seem inconceivable now. Xenoblade? Is it Xenoblade? Is it Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles? Would you not agree? Alberius? GLES 2.5 Anniversary. Raid event. Dang, that's hot version of Yudin right there. That's Alberius. Is Midgar- Is human Midgar Summer? Oh! Whoa! He looks so good looking! Yo, finally we get another human version of a dragon that is for gonna be maybe a playable character? That is so hot. Dude, human Midgar Summer is real. Even before human Jupiter. That's kind of messed up for human Jupiter and <laughs> human Mercury. But still, we finally get another human alt. That is crazy. That is awesome. It is very hype. Dude, that that guy was so good looking. Human Mega Summer, so good looking. Dude, oh, he's a playable character. Oh, we got his 3D model. That's it's over. It's over. It's over. If he's but if he's gonna be a playable character like a free welfare unit, then he's, that's gonna be really sad. I hope that he's gonna be a summonable character. Dude, we're all gonna be broke though. Dude, we got this this guy, this good looking guy, Alberius, good looking. We got these two husbando, Midgar Summer husbando. We got husbando left, husbando right. Here a husbando, there a husbando, everywhere a husbando. Donna Dragelia had a farm. E I I O. We got a farm for Wormite. In a time of strife and sorrow, a new pact was formed between people and dragons. Yo, dude, we got and we got Mirit, dude. I'm. Um, Going all in on this bat. I don't care if they're permanent oh, units. We go all in on that yeah, junk. Humanoid Midgard former and Miriam? We we are. What does it all mean? Yeah, what does it all mean? Looks like that was ages ago too. The new son of Dragon. Dude, he's look at how handsome he is. Look at how handsome they made my boy right there. The event. Work with your bugs to take down the raid boss. Okay. We've got one more video for you. Roll it, Ranzel! <gasps> Another video? Ranzel? Hello, everyone. Oh, you how's it going? I'm the director of the Dragalia Lost Game, which is enjoying its two and a half year anniversary, thanks to the passion and support of players like you. Let's take some time to talk about what's in store. You got that uh, Corona look right there. The Corona cuts. You need to cut his hair. By talking about not snow. I need to cut my hair, too. Earn encyclopedia bonuses by logging more units and upgrading them? And the battles that you've fought. In the encyclopedia section, you can browse the adventurers and dragons you've collected. You can so, unlock encyclopedia bonuses that boost the stats of your adventurers and dragons. Oh, okay, so the more you... You, like... You can also earn epithets by completing... So the more you read their stories, the stronger they become? I guess this is a way to incentivize reading the stories. to relive the thrill of summoning your favorite adventurer, or if you simply missed it the first time around... Oh, that's pretty cool. I, I like that. It's like if you accidentally press something and you missed the animation. That's pretty cool. ...sorted by element, weapon type, or unit type. This is a great way to see the yeah, dopamine forever and if you want to relive that hype gotcha moment forever and ever, then yeah, be Although battle records do not provide any bonus stat boosts, you can earn epithets by completing endeavors. Why does my screen look so weird? Whoops. 
Now let's move on to some quality of life improvements. The maximum player level currently sits at 200, but it will be increased to 250. Similarly, the maximum number of skip tickets that you can hold currently sits at 200. This will be increased to 400. Plus, Ooh, maximum. Thank you for increasing the skip tickets to 400. Introduce Trials of the Mighty. Dude, yeah, Request so many Tiki. I'll relive that moment forever and ever. Trials of the Mighty will be challenged to take on various bosses with a team of one or more predetermined elements and weapon types. You may have Thor's trial, Poseidon Tron, Zephyr's trial. They've got some new tricks up there. Sorry that the dimensions of the video are kind of weird, chat. Sorry about that. I apologize. I should have checked beforehand. Materials used to unlock nodes in the mana spirals of Gala Dragalia Adventurers will be available from this quest in April. Dude, okay. Gala Princess Devotion, Conviction, Nature. Oh, at least we get Nature's Blessing and Dragon Scales from this. That's pretty good. Any daily bonuses for Trials of the Mighty that you don't earn on a given day will be available to earn later. Okay, yeah, it's part of a daily bonus. That's pretty good. And considering it's a daily bonus, this is something we could get every day. The user interface and other features. We plan to make unlocking nodes in mana circles. Five mana circles at once and use- Oh, thank you. That makes it so much- Dude, quality of life changes. Are they going to add more area to the Halidom? That would be cool. If they added more land. What teams are most popular for taking on various high difficulty quests. So if you're wondering how to tackle them yourself- It's the afternoon stream. It's- do we- I don't know why they, they decided- show it during the lunch break but on a thursday more more or less this is saiga dude why does it that he was once part of the mysterious mikuroshi dang he why do we have so many husbandos like good looking husbandos coming up this young man it's like they're pandered dude right here this is orion like good looking version of orion Hey, so many husbandos. This is the husbando digest right here. Oh, we this is oh Tobias salt. We got Tobias salt. But you'll have to play the event to discover the details. That's pretty cool. Dang, a lot of this is yeah. Oh, <gasps> summer. Wow, they already showing the summer units. This is like four months ahead. Get ready for some okay, bonus. Alex, I could get behind that. We got Alisan too. Summer Alex, that's pretty that's pretty good. Which require you to change oh dang. Uh this is a lot. Legend, okay, we got Shella's Wrath. Oh uh I I couldn't read fast in time. What the heck is this? Whoa, this is a lot. And now for something completely different. Happy to announce that a CD containing various Dragalia Lost event songs will be available for purchase. Ooh! This compilation spans from Get Up, the theme song from the Scars of the Syndicate event in March 2020. Ooh, okay, so they got... The theme song. Yeah, a lot of the music um, in that span of time was... And here's a video yeah, they're very Bayonetta bosses, right? A lot of the music during those times was really good. And some of the... a lot of the events... 90 to 21 chapter! Oh, what? Who's? Oh, this is a. Uh, uh, oh, what's his name? Um, Fl Fl Floretia or whatever. No, um, I forget his name already. I was like, putting to use in the daily lives for ages upon ages. Targets acquired. Commencing termination. Please watch over me, O King. To your soul, I offer them as tribute. Silence. You are just. Miserable puppet who don't know a thing. Annihilation mode activated. <laughs> what we got another Galaxy going on now? Like Galaxy Part Two? It is right. What? <laughs> Where does this guy come from? A foolish fairy, the prince of a foreign land. Oh, it, Finn Lorda. That's his name. It's fairy version of Charles from Epic Seven. <laughs> so maybe may be attempting to throw the fairy kingdom into chaos. This is Detective Burns from, um, and this is Champion Zerato. 
Uh, listen, everyone. What I want is peace. It's just in a thread unites to converge. The question of Nedrex Packworm, the Fairy King schemes, the Nad Shadow Northern, uh, uh, Prayer of Ferris's Skewer Intent, the Holy War in Louisian, Alex's Anguish. Th there's so many things happening at once. Uh, how do we keep track of all this? There's too many needs, too many going on at once. Under the Sacred Tree, a dramatic tale. Chapter 20, Chapter 21, whoa! In two halves. Okay, I like how they do it in two halves. It's a lot easier to digest. How fitting because this is a Dragalia digest. How did you like the preview for chapters 19 through 21? The prince will finally learn more about his mysterious origins as the fairy kingdom becomes more and more involved. Main story chapters will continue to be released in halves each month from April to September. Hope that you'll be right yeah, there. when it was when it used to be all at once, it was like, oh dang, the story because the stories themselves are now, really long. Video, Chapters, we? I mean, reading through all of it takes like hours. <gasps> Fire Emblem, Kindred Ties, best part one. That's year two. Was year three? Can you show us the units for? Dude, that Fire Emblem Hero collab. Fire Emblem Hero collab. This confirms part three, right? Anna? There's, there has to be. Anna has to be the welfare unit in the next one. Some in showcases, including adventurers such as Mark and Tiki, will also make a return. Oh, Dark Osada, you don't have Veronica yet. Last but yet. not least, let's check out this final video. Fire Emblem Heroes. What? Fear not, Bloodkin. It is I, Vania. Who the heck is that? In late April, we'll hold an event featuring Vania and another adventurer from games including Rage of Bahama. Okay, Rage of Bahama fans, rejoice. I don't know who this is, but she she's adorable. She's kawaii. Halloween in April? Okay. That about wraps up this episode of Dragalia Digest. What? As you've seen, you're not going to announce viral events pure collab in store for Dragalia Lost. So I hope that you're as excited as no, I No, this can't be the end. And a half year anniversary and beyond. No, there's still three minutes. There's still three minutes! You promised us 20 minutes, Dragalia. Man, it sounds like there's a boatload of fun stuff coming to Dragalia Lost. But before I let you go... Okay, yes! There's one more present from me to you. Come on. Do it. Monster Hunter or Fire Emblem... Uh, oh... Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you. Three tenfold, okay. But I'm looking forward to going on many, many, many more adventures together. Bye. What? No, don't, 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 don't. What? No. There's no collab this year. There's no collab this year? What? No, don't do this. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. No. There. Uh, I thought there was going to be a Fire Emblem Heroes collab this year too. But it's not happening? Did, did Psy Games, did you run out of money? Run out of money to collab with Intelligent Systems? Did you also run out of money to collaborate with Capcom? I think Capcom is in charge of Monster Hunter, right? How do you not... I hope they, they better announce something. That that was so... I mean, the only hype thing about that... Let's look at the YouTube uh, chat right here. Yeah, there's... Oh man, those people are saying like trash. Fancy clown says trash. Uh Yep. Uh I expected so much. Expected so much, y'all. I know what what if if they did that they would get so pooped on. Oh no. No, don't do that. No collab, huh? The best collab is no collab, really? Is that... 
Did they not? Ugh. Rage of Bahama. Is it? Is. I mean, they're bringing characters from. That doesn't really count. I don't. As a collab. Because it's like. I mean, then you could say, oh, Lily and all the other characters that came from those games. That's a collab. Right? And it's their same IP. So. Human Mids, that's pretty high. That's the only thing I'm really excited about. Human Midgard Stormer. Um, but, oh man, that was really... Uh, I must say, I'm pretty underwhelmed. Uh, actually, not underwhelmed. Whelmed. Connected to the event, which is focused on Rage of Bahamut. But that's not really a collab event, though, right? And Rage of Bahamut is side games. It's not like, you know, Monster Hunter or, um, like Princess Connect or, or actually Princess Connect is kind of their IP, but, um, yeah, Midgard Storm, Human Midgard Storm is probably the highlight of this whole thing. Uh, and so, Right, but I mean Mega Man or uh, Fire Emblem, not even Fire Emblem Heroes. You'd think after two years going strong with it, uh, it was the collab at it was a collab at the time. Well, right, but my point is, there's really no collab soon. That's like outside of side games i was hoping for that too but um or even not even yeah a rerun at the very least but uh jeez uh i mean like all this stuff is pretty nice what the heck is with the video I guess the video's still uploading, that's why it's all weird like this. Uh, maybe they will. We'll see. Uh, uh. I'm disappointed. <laughs> really disappointed. I was hoping to hear about like a really hype collab. And I mean, not even... A lot of people don't really know about Rage of Bahamut. Um, in before the Rage of Bahamut fans are like, uh, actually, uh, Rage of Bahamut was one of the biggest games that came during this time. Uh, how do you not know, you stupid idiot? Uh, well, to that I say, okay, is it as popular as like Fire Emblem or Monster Hunter? Probably not. Uh, yeah, as popular as Persona? Probably not. Uh, yeah, it, I mean, they've been doing Fire Emblem every year, which, I mean, two and a half years is not a very long history, I know, but it's really weird why they wouldn't do it for this year. Uh, yeah, we'll see, maybe there'll be a Digest Part 2 or something. Uh, or to make it more hype, they just don't say anything about it to keep it very secret. Why would they see the thing is the thing that bugged me was why would they say something about uh let's see where is it why would they have said something about Fire Emblem like oh we're doing a rerun uh right here and then say nothing about a part three. That is really weird and disgusting. To add Alphonse, and the latter to add Shirena to your team as adventurers. Yeah, well, I guess so. Uh, ooh, yeah. It is I, Vania. 
Whoa, I'm supposed to be so hyped about this. Oh my goodness. I don't even know who she is though. And another adventurer from games including Rage of Bahamut. Further details on this adventurer will be made available at a later date. So stay tuned. Wow, another a lowly girl. That's like Halloween version of Lily. Well, it is I, Venya. I feel like they would have said, okay, first of all, they would have had a, a probably a logo prepared for a Rage of Bahamut collab event, and they would have probably maybe said it's a collab event. Rage of Bahama. Further details on this adventurer will be made available at a later date. Uh, so stay tuned. That would be really if it, if Rage of Bahama is the collab of this season. That would be pretty well. That about underwhelming. This episode of Dragalia Digest. Like, seen, oh my there goodness. Are new features, events, and more in store for Dragalia Lost. So I hope that you're as excited as I am. I, there's, there's a lot of husbandos too. I mean, I count like Human Midgar Sormora. Uh, how many husbandos were there announced? Let's have a counter up and ready. What the heck? Okay. So there's a. Uh, let me try to scrub through. Yeah, Alberius. We got Alberius, Human Midgar Summer. That's two already. Uh, and then. Uh, I think three more were announced after that. Oh, yeah, Saiga. That's three, four, five. That was a lot. That was a lot coming up. Five, including. um. Where was it? Uh, who knows if this this guy maybe Finlorda is summonable, uh, and then this maybe this guy is summonable. Who knows? That's like seven, six, seven already. Uh, this guy's interesting. Well, uh. I'm gonna go drown my sorrows in my lunch that I'm eating, that I'll eat soon. So, um, thank you guys for joining the stream. And, uh, yeah, pretty whelmed, to say the least. But hey, human Midgard's armor, that's something.